Box of Lowdown and I'm back with another video. Just thought I'd give my reaction really to the news, the you know, the worst kept secret in boxing right now, that Luke Campbell and Vasily Lomachenko will be going at it in August next month at the O2. You know, a big clash here for the vacant WBC lightweight title. The WBA and the WBO lightweight titles will also be on the line, as well as the ring lightweight title. So this is it. This is a massive test. We get to see one of the pound for pound greats, Vasil Lomachenko, on these shores. You know, he came over here when Alexander Usyk fought Tony Bellew um, and he loved it. He loved the atmosphere, he loved the vibe, he loved the crowd and he wanted a piece of the action. Luke Campbell, you know, an Olympic gold medalist just like Vasil Lomachenko. This is his big chance, his massive opportunity here. He's, let's make no mistake about it, he's going to go in there as a big underdog. Vasil Lomachenko is just amazing, one of the best fighters ever, well, one of the best fighters to put on a pair of gloves, you know. Um, he's going to be going up there against a phenomenal talent, pound for pound fighter, um, skilled operator, somebody that's been there, done it in the amateur scene, um, making waves in the professional scene, untouchable as a professional and pretty much as an amateur. He's been that good, Vasil Lomachenko. So these two guys know each other well though on the amateur circuit. As I've said, both of them are Olympic gold medalists. Uh, Vasil Lomachenko, a double Olympic gold medalist. But Luke Campbell will know Vasil Lomachenko. He's seen him fight before. These two guys, like I've said, have seen each other on the amateur circuit. So Luke Campbell knows what he's going in there against. Um, it's a massive challenge though, a massive challenge against a phenomenal talent. Somebody who's looked pretty much unbeatable really. Um, the only thing that I can really see beating Vasil Lomachenko right now is weight. You know, if he steps up like a weight division, which is, you know, out of his remit, then that's where he could get beaten. But skill for skill, if he's comfortable at the weight, I can't really see anyone beating him. But Luke Campbell's got a massive opportunity here in front of his home fans to take on Vasil Lomachenko and, you know, beat a pound for pound number one fighter in the world. You know, that's how big it is. And we're going to see him over here in the UK. I'm sure that we're going to give Lomachenko a great reception. And uh, he was there in the crowd last night at White Rivas. Him and Luke Campbell went head to head in the ring. And, um, you know, you could hear the reaction from the crowd already that this is something that's really going to build into a big fight. I expect the O2 to be a sellout. And um, it's going to be a massive fight, a massive ask for Luke Campbell, man. One that's going to be very, very difficult to master. You know, mastering that matrix of Lomachenko. How does he do it? Do you give him a chance at all? Do you think that he can win it? Um, it's going to be interesting, but something that he's going to be he's going to be pushed to you know the very limits of his ability luke campbell will be and more so let me know what you guys think about the fight uh credit to luke campbell for taking it on i mean there is some titles at stake there so it's not like it's for nothing and i'm sure he'll be getting paid well for it but let me know you guys thoughts and opinions on it do you think that luke campbell has a chance at all or do you think that lomachenko just blows him out um you know he does have the height and reach over lomachenko he was significantly taller but Lomachenko would have faced these kind of guys in the amateurs, all sorts of styles, all sorts of different like fighting abilities and heights and reaches and everything else. So he ain't going to be faced by that at all. But let me know what you guys think, man. It should be a very interesting fight. We'll be down there with the fan cams. I know I haven't been out there with the fan cams for the last couple of fights, but we'll be bringing the fan cams back to that one. And um, it should be a very good night of boxing. So let me know what you guys think about it. Drop your thoughts in the comment section below. I'll catch you guys on the next one.